Anyway, seeing as how I've got you here, guys, I wanted to show you something which um, I noticed in the last game I played, which was actually really cool. This kind of means that you can turn every alien in the universe, convert them to being your race using this method. Bear in mind my um, consumer goods right, are a um, bit of a problem right now, but that's not really a problem. I was just working on rejigging the economy to fix that. I've gone down the gone down this path, basically. So I've gone, first of all, for the flesh is weak, which will be upgrade all of your species. In fact, everyone. It will upgrade every organic being to a cyborg and cyborgs are pretty awesome i'll just go over quickly what the buff does here we go cybernetic so plus 20 percent habitability uh, again this is um great if you've got a big vampire with a lot of different planets and um, a lot of different species so yeah habitability is great does does 10 army damage plus 10 leadership lifespan and it also gives you certain bonuses so um all of your leaders and admirals and stuff will, will probably have some kind of cybernetic bonus and actually these are really cool and then i went fully sort of upgraded fully okay i went with synthetic evolution so it's about time to abandon the flawed organic vessels for then prison our minds by transitioning our neural patterns into synthetic bodies we will achieve a higher state of being okay so this increases robot output by 10 percent um gives you one robot modification point and modify species special project cost is minus 50 percent 50% time, I, I assume, or it doesn't actually specify. And what that does is it changes all of your species into robots, right? But because I actually had like a different variation of my species, I could actually change some of my species back to being cyborgs. So what I've ended up doing is every single species I encounter now will be assimilated, okay? And assimilation will basically turn them into the unibirds and then if i hypothetically wanted to change these robots back into cybernetic um beings i can literally just apply the template and then i can literally upgrade every single every single population to being my main species so in a funny sort of way the ultimate like xenophile type thing to actually change every single you know species in the universe to actually being your species now i don't think this was intended by the developers literally all i had is i had a different variation of my species which wasn't actually deleted when i upgraded to cybernetic or sorry when i um upgraded to mechanical and now there used to be another glitch right where you would go um set rights and i think they might have stopped this but the other cool thing about upgrading is you can actually keep your living standards to utopian abundance okay now obviously as you guys know utopian abundance is amazing because any unemployed population will actually start having normal happiness and they'll produce unity in science okay so just means that if you've got massive amount of population in your galaxy well that's that's not not really a problem anymore as long as you can produce enough consumer goods for everyone that's not a problem it also means that um i think i've also got the nihilistic acquisition trait on here i can actually um attack an alien empire okay i can um use nihilistic acquisition to steal their population um the population will then be upgraded to the synthetics okay um my um they'll be upgraded to robots and then i can downgrade the robots to back to my original species now i don't necessarily think that the this is a downgrade because you know like i say the there are some really good perks of having cybernetic but um yeah anyway um i just thought that was another sort of play option which was really interesting so hope you found the video useful um let me know what you thought in the comments and please subscribe and if you want to chuck me a few coins on patreon you will be the first probably but uh, that will be freaking amazing but thank you very much guys and uh, speak to you soon